All right, trying something new today. Got uh, the two camera view. One camera facing forward with the navigation screen and my phone for me. So today I'm going to test out the new traffic light and stop sign control feature in autopilot. Right now it's in beta. Um, but the idea is that the car will stop at all stop signs and traffic lights and for the traffic lights no matter what the color of the light the co car will attempt to come to a stop if the light is green you have to tell it to go ahead and proceed by either um, pressing down on the shift lever or tapping the the accelerator pedal um, and then if the light is red and you attempt any of those maneuvers it'll still stop um and yeah, so we'll give it a test here, driving around town a little bit. All right, so I'm gonna engage autopilot. Woo, good start. And uh, here we have a red light. You can see here, stopping for traffic control in 100 feet. And it shows the um, line where it thinks the intersection is. And you can even see the two red lights up there, just barely. All right, the lights turned green and it recognizes that. So if I hit the stock, it'll know it's okay to proceed through the intersection. Now the idea is that if the light were to change after I confirmed, it would recognize that and it would attempt to stop again. Looks like if the light turned yellow or red. Got another Tesla passing us on the left. <laughs> the Tesla wave. All right, got another red light. Now if I attempt to acknowledge it, confirm it, it knows that it's red, it's still gonna stop. So it's smart enough not to pay attention to me if it knows better. All right, light turned green, it knows it, acknowledge. Safe to proceed. Oh, look, it even had that pedestrian there. All right, let's see. Follow these cars through this intersection, okay. It's at a little bit of an angle. There we go, not bad. Okay, knows there's another light. It knows it's green. It's gonna try and stop unless I tell it go ahead. And there we go, continuing through. Another light, let's say go ahead. Oh, got a car in front of us. Okay, all clear. Oh, that's all right. Another light. Doesn't quite, there we go, red. So it seems to use the map data to kind of know where intersections are and whether they're stop signs or red lights. And then um, when it when the camera can actually see the color of the light is when it obviously when it can actually tell what color it is so I think if it's obstructed and can't tell what color the light is then it will attempt to stop no matter what and I would have to disengage autopilot to proceed through um, maybe that's something we'll get to test out all right green recognize it go follow traffic Right. Oh, 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 it's getting confused about the lane lines. I'm gonna have to help it here. There we go. Now we got some merging lanes. So let's see what happens. Okay, so just stay away from the curb. There we go. Now this feature still works even when auto steer is disengaged. As long as you have auto cruise control on, you can see it's recognizing that we have a traffic signal, but it can't quite tell. Oh, that, oh it sort of knows. Let's see, there we go. Oh, come on. Doesn't like when people are turning in front of us sometimes. Now we need to find ourselves a stop sign to test on. Turn back, another light, confirm. Nope, it doesn't like this intersection. I've gotta help it through a little, oh, shit. There we go, oh, there was a double light there, I think. Freaked out. <laughs> All right, let's continue through here. I'm not really sure where we're going, so let's change lanes to the right. 
auto lane change, good. The other thing is um, normally with auto steer, you can go five miles over the speed limit in the city, but with the, the traffic light and stop sign control, you can only go the speed limit. So I'm limited to 25 here. On the hot highway with, um, oh, there's a point, uh, coronavirus testing facility right there. Huh, I didn't know there was one nearby. Um, with uh, navigate on autopilot in on the freeway, you can go like as much over as you want. I think maybe up to 90, um, but they have more limits than city driving. All right, knows we've got a traffic light coming up. Hasn't seen what color it is yet. There we, now we know it's red. Oh, no, oh, see, I had the habit of confirming to go through, but it didn't let me because it's red. And look at that, it stopped all on its own. And now it won't let me make any changes until it sees the light changes color. So let's see how this goes. This intersection's a little tricky. It's, the lines are painted pretty well, so. Hopefully it does okay. And here we go. Okay, as long as it's, oh, nope, 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 doesn't like it, doesn't like it. I wasn't sure we went, if it should follow the left or the right line. Okay, another traffic light. Oh, it changed to yellow. Ah, I should see stopping, it shows it's yellow, amazing. There we go. I believe the cameras you are used to um, see where the, the line is too for the intersection. So at least as a confirmation to what the map data shows. You can even see it recognizes the bike lane sometimes when there's that little bike symbol there. There you go. Oops. Get back. Recognizes the double line on the left, single line on the right, bike lane. There you go. Ooh, you can even see it on the left side. You can see garbage cans. Ooh, that was a little tight. Uh, Oh, oh, I think there's a traffic control here. Sorry, uh, that was not a stop sign. Stopping for traffic control, stop sign. All right, here we go. Hopefully there's nobody in front of us. Well, right now there is. Oh, okay, and we're at a T intersection. So we have to choose a left or a right. First it'll stop. Let's go right, that looks quaint. There we go, complete stop. Oh, autopilot unable to proceed. It knows it can't go straight and it currently can't do turns through intersections. Ooh, a leaf pile blocking our path. What's gonna happen here? Don't wanna drive through it, so I'm hitting the brakes. Oh, no, just okay. kidding, that's like a mulch pile. Gotta go around it. So, um, our autopilot still has stuff like that to work on, little obstacles. And I put the speed back up, but it should be stopping for this stop sign, which is kind of an odd direction, so that uh, was great. Traffic control, there I can see it. That it knows it's green, nice, confirm. Straight through, oh, turned yellow. Look, you can see it, but we were already in the intersection. That's good, so it didn't react. I really wanna get a light that turns yellow before we get to it, after I've already confirmed to go through. This whole time I've had my foot over the 
accelerator and the brake while using autopilot just in case but uh, it's been good confirm green go hard just can't see the lines here but i think we're kind of following the car in front of us there we go another intersection excuse me green confirm we gotta see if we can get one to change all right another one 400 feet got this bus blocking it okay this is a good little test there we go it sees it's green confirm intersection uh, nice pretty well got through it nice model s there on the right okay another light confirm oh that one turned yellow oh good look at that oh that was perfect oh this one's yellow red so we're gonna have to stop that was great we hadn't reached the intersection yet and it didn't attempt to break at all and i wouldn't have we had plenty of time to get through. The cars behind me all stopped, but that seemed very reasonable. And I'm surprised the car didn't freak out. I'm very happy. So there we go. I got what I wanted. Let's see if we can get uh, another round or two. And here we have four lights. You can see them all there. And it should recognize the turn light. Yeah, look at that. You can see it's green, and you can't really see if it's an arrow, but it does recognize arrows. Um, can't tell here. We're too far away. But it did recognize it was a different color. Here we go. Green. Confirm. Okay, we got another very short uh, distance between the next light and this one. So let's see what happens. Green, go. Next light, 200 feet, go. And piece of cake. Ooh, this one doesn't have any lane line painted on the ground or limit line rather but we stopped and it's got the pedestrian there great great very nice oh my god it's coming up to the car green go oh this is another back to back That one doesn't have much time to go from one to the next, but that was not bad. As soon as we got past the first light, it immediately started braking or slowing, but I was able to confirm right away and it was a pretty smooth transition. Except now we have a lot of uh, antsy traffic behind us. Green, come on, there we go, confirm. Oh shit, ambulance, no sirens. Oh, yellow, oh, that was another good one, huh. That one I probably should have stopped at because I saw it turn red, but uh, I think that was, I entered when it was yellow. Oh, this will be, here's one. Oh, there we go. I think that one changed. So that one I can, it had seen green pretty early and uh, I had confirmed and then it turned yellow as we were approaching. It recognized it and then uh, decided to stop. Awesome. Very cool uh, stop sign animation here, by the way. Very realistic. I mean, wow, it even sees those garbage cans in the dr dr driveway over there. Let's zoom out a little. Garbage cans. It remembers these garbage cans back there between the two houses. Or maybe you can see them with the side camera. Very cool. All right. Carry on. We're going to go down one of these other neighborhoods and see if we can catch some more stop signs. I'd like to try proceeding through a stop sign. I haven't really gotten to test that much yet. 
stop sign, cool. And I'm gonna leave auto steer off. It doesn't even look like it's gonna let me try to use it. Oh shit, did not like this at all. All right, stopping, stopped and go. Nice, pretty good for having some pretty congested streets. Let's get our speed limit up to 20 here, even though the speed limit's 25. T intersection, huh, that's new. I haven't even, don't think I've even seen that in other people's videos. But there is a stop sign there, I can see it. So we'll see what happens if it changes its mind. Ooh, this is a little tricky. Yeah, there we go, now it sees the stop sign. Nobody's behind me. Stopping, proceed. Now I have to make my turn. Shit. Okay. <laughs> yeah. Eh, it's not really meant to do those, so I'm definitely pushing it. Okay, you got there first. Now I'm stopped. Now I said go ahead before that guy passed, but it seemed to work fine. Ooh, actually that was a good one. Ooh, that had a traffic circle. All right, we gotta go back. I haven't gotten to try a traffic circle yet, though. I've seen that it definitely does not like those. All right, this will be interesting. I'm gonna slow it down. And it's gonna drive over the curb. There we go, avoided that, but uh, yeah, it didn't, uh, didn't really care for that, noticing that one too much. Let's turn right here. After you, we stopped, okay, well we can go. Oops, just kidding, I told it to go a little too early, sorry. Come on, you can do it. I see you, all right. So I should have just kept going straight before. Let's test this again. And curb! <laughs> oh shit. All right, gotta be careful with that. <laughs> Don't mess with uh, curbs too much or parked cars. Ooh, okay. Stopped a little short there. Complete stop, confirm. Ooh, and we're gonna have a busy set of people here. You go, you go, I'm gonna go. Come on, baby. There we go. Ooh, pedestrian. Stop sign. Seem to slow down a little extra for the pedestrian. Ooh, we got a blind intersection. So there I just tapped the gas to creep forward and it thought um, that meant to go through the stop sign, but I just needed to stop twice for this blind intersection. So that is definitely one of the features or one of the quirks of this that you have to be careful with is that if there's a blind intersection and you need to creep forward without going through, you have to make sure to be ready to hit the brakes again. Because you get used to driving a Tesla with the um, regenerative braking on, it practically stops on its own a lot of times. And uh, got a little impatient person there. Um, so you don't use the brakes a lot, like right now, I just took my foot off the accelerator and the car comes to a stop, so definitely something to watch out for. All right, I traffic lights are kind of blocked from my view because of this van, but it acts like it can still see them. Oh, no, we can't see their green now. There we go. I had to wait for that van to proceed before it acknowledged they were green and let me continue through the intersection. Ooh, we had a weird phantom break there. Okay, it's painted, so we should get through it okay. A little fast, oops, slowing, oh shit. Okay, I thought there was a traffic line there. It was odd. This is where we pay attention. Pedestrian in the median, great. All right, it's going pretty well overall. As long as you know what to expect. I've been pretty happy with its um, how aggressive it stops and how aggressive it uh, speeds up after you tell it to go at the where you're stopped from where you're stopped. Um, like it doesn't slow down too early or too slowly, 
and then when it accelerates again, it goes at a decent pace. Nothing that seems like it would piss anybody off that's behind you. Um, so that's good. It feels pretty natural. Okay, turning. Clear. I wish it was a little more aggressive with those kinds of situations where somebody's turning out of the lane of travel. It like almost, it'll stop until they're completely out of the lane, which honestly, um, not really how I think most people drive, not how I drive. Like, you know they're gonna get out of the way and if for some reason they didn't, you'll, you'd have to hit the brakes, but um, I like keeping traffic moving smoothly. All right, I think I'll stop it here. Thanks for joining me on this first test of the stop light and stop sign control beta. I hope you've enjoyed watching and saw some good tests of the feature. And uh, let me know what you think in the comments. Hit that like button and subscribe for more future videos of Tesla. Blessings on blessings on blessings. Look at my life, man. That's lessons on lessons on lessons. I treat the be like. Right there. Okay. Find the lane. No. Car stopped there. Okay. Okay. Had a little trouble. Okay, it's fine. Ooh, having a little trouble. With these tight lane spaces. Yeah. So, uh, Not shit. Come on. Having a lot of trouble here. It's not sticking to the, to the center line. It's trying to center itself in the lane too much. And there's just too many cars parked along the edge. There's, I mean, it's tight, but there's plenty of space here. It doesn't like that the space is opening and closing so much. There we go. Yeah. Oh, okay. Well, okay, here we go. This is an interesting situation. We've got a split intersection. Yeah, I really didn't know what to do with that one. Yeah, everybody thinks there's one here. There's definitely not. So I'm not going to let it stop, and hopefully that helps uh, train the data set a little. Oh, that was weird. Thought maybe there was a stop sign there too. It must be those red uh, bus signs, maybe. It's getting a little confused. Hey, thanks for sticking around for this bonus footage. Go!